So I have on my most festive Christmas sweater today. It's kind of hard to tell, but Olaf actually lights up. So it's a super, super fun sweater. And I have that on because I have one of the Ugly Christmas Sweaters mystery pin boxes to open. This is the limited release mystery pin set for this holiday season, available both at Disneyland and Walt Disney World. And I think it's such a cool idea for mystery pins. Ugly sweaters now are like, everywhere in all the stores. They're so mainstream that it's almost hard to find like actual ugly sweaters and not just like manufactured to look ugly sweaters. But I like that Disney is kind of trying to pay homage to that with these pins. So this is a limited release set since it's only going to be available in the parks during this holiday season while supplies lasts and there's no chaser pins in there. But there's 10 different possible pins and the box is super cute because it actually looks like a little Christmas sweater. Since it's a limited release set, not the cheapest, one box is $19.99, so $10 per pin. And then I'm going to show all of the pin options you can get. So here are all the 10 options that you can get in this mystery box. Looks like you got Mickey, 101 Dalmatians, Cheshire Cat, Donald, Baymax, Stitch. Goofy, Peter Pan, Dumbo, and Snow White. And I really, really, really want that Mickey Mouse. Okay, so all I want is a Mickey Mouse sweater inside. That is what I'm really, really hoping for. I definitely would also be happy with a Baymax sweater. I think Stitch and Snow White are also okay too, but I don't like the sweater vests as much as I like the full sweaters. So let's open into this box and take out our blind bags with our ugly Christmas sweater pins. All right, two pins in here. These definitely feel like a thicker blind bag plastic, but either way, I always just go right to my scissors. So let's open up a first pin. We'll see, can I get a Mickey Mouse? And this pin is a Dumbo. So I don't really know how I feel about this pin. I mean, I guess they are supposed to be like ugly Christmas sweaters, so they're not supposed to look that cute. So it's okay, but definitely one that I think I would like to trade for another from the set. Okay, because I only had one box, I only have one more chance to get Mickey Mouse. Can I get lucky? This pin is not lucky. This pin is Peter Pan. I do at least like this pin better than the Dumbo pin. I think it works better as a sweater but not super in love with either of them. Here's a closer look at the Dumbo and Peter pins. So Dumbo just feels a little weird for a few reasons. It almost looks a little bit too much like Dumbo himself, just in kind of how things are designed. It's also sort of oddly cropped, but also with a turtleneck. So they at least definitely succeeded in making an ugly sweater. <laughs> I do like this Peter Pan one better. It's a little bit more of a cardigan style. I like the design more, how it's more Peter Pan inspired instead of just kind of looking like a morphed version of a character. But unfortunately, no luck with these sweater pins. So this was a bit of a zero luck mystery unboxing. I've kind of been on a bit of a low streak on my video where I just opened a bunch of the mystery pin pouches. It was 20 pins total and there wasn't a single pin that I wanted to end up keeping. I'm definitely gonna end up trading both of these pins. Hopefully I can get a Mickey, but I'm gonna take that as a sign to mean that the next time I open up mystery pins, I better have awesome luck and get all the ones that I want. So thank you for joining for this quick little Pinsmas installment, and thanks for watching.